test or an idea of passing some type of law, how would you handle it here? I do have a solution. Well, Arizona uh, is the state that has more illegal immigrants than any other state in the nation. We don't really have that significant of a problem here, but they're, they're certainly here. I think Arizona has done the right thing. Uh, the federal government has not uh, done, uh, protected our borders, they've not controlled the borders, uh, and so Arizona is simply trying to stop uh, this flow of illegals from coming into the country, that, coming into their state, it's just eating up their state budgets, it's eating up federal dollars uh, for the benefits that these people receive. So first and foremost, and as I've said pretty consistently for the last several years, is first and foremost we have to make sure we control our borders. Uh, if you're not a sovereign state, uh, if you can't control your borders. How do you do that? You build a wall. You put the, the forces on there, the technology that you need to build that wall to stop that flow of illegal immigrants. Second thing you need to do uh, is make sure that businesses that knowingly hire illegals should be fined significantly. I believe, though, that most companies that hire illegals are doing it unknowingly. Because I would be hard-pressed to find anybody here that would be able to take a Social Security card or some other form of of uh, identification that we put forward, and know that it was that it was fake or know that it was forged. It's very difficult to do. But we have the technology today to do a biometric card. If, an, if someone comes to our country, immigrants immigrates here legally, they get a biometric card. So you take it. Either your business has the technology, or the local police department or the county courthouse, somebody would have it where you swipe it and you say, okay, this person is here legally in this country. Um,